Holy smokes! 3,700 gold from the jelly and the cheese. Oh, I love jelly and cheese. Okay, let's make loads more. It could have been the mayo, though, that tipped it over. Who knows? 5,000 gold. Again, I think that means we can do the next reward at the vault. Yeah, 5,000 gold bundle. That's a big, big investment, though, and I could be spending that gold on other cool things like a stable. I really want a stable. Let's go and see Robin and see what a stable costs. But before we do that, let's check the weather report. Cloudy tomorrow. Okay. Oops. And today's recipe is a fish recipe. Cool. Okay. Let's do it. Excellent. So the bok choy is prepared. And we're going to make a killing off of this one. Oh, yeah. Loads of money. We've also got... What is this stuff? Eggplants. Ah, oh, nice. We can make eggplant jelly as well. I forgot the eggplants regrow. Now, is that wheat finished? I can't remember what day I planted it. And you have to gather wheat with a scythe. Ah, uh, I think one more day is what it needs. This is the third. This is the third day, and I think tomorrow is the fourth day. Oh no, we left the chicken pen open. These guys have been out all night, cold probably. So there's no other crops to farm. We will have to water them though. But before we do that, let's sell all of this delicious bok choy. But we'll hold on to a couple, like I said, just in case, because you never know when a quest is going to want some bok choy. And we'll hold on to the eggplants as well because they can make eggplant jelly. Right, time to water and tend to the animals. All right, great job. We've watered everything. Now let's say hello to ye old animals. Now they're so much more difficult to track down when they're outside of their barn. So in future, I've got to make sure. Oops, can't milk. <laughs> Pecky bitch doesn't produce milk. Sorry about that. Got to make sure I lock up the pens at night, because otherwise these guys get out and they're really difficult to track down. Also, the fences are starting to break, so these guys could get lost. Glug, glug, glug. All right. So, yeah, there's actually... Oh, man. This... There's a huge opening in the fence that I didn't even realize. Let's put down some fence before these animals escape. We're pretty lucky, actually, because if I left... I left it out overnight, and that means not only can the animals escape, but also there's a chance that wolves can come and, and eat them. Which is certainly not what you want, either. There we go! Fence is repaired. Everything looks good. Let's make ourselves some cheese to celebrate. Right, so it's 12.20pm. Let's go and find Haley, give her her daily gift, and see if there's any cool quests outside Pierre's. Oh, Monsieur Pierre, you have such a beautiful shop. I want to buy all of it, but I cannot, because I do not have any money. I've got 5,000 gold, though. Oh, that's what we were going to do. We were going to see Robin. See if she's... Hey, what's up, Lewis? Some of those townsfolk are wary of strangers. You'll have to win their trust before they open up to you. We could be going around giving people gifts, I suppose. We haven't been doing that. In fact, let's start as we mean to go on and give... a sunflower to Jody. It's a really nice gift. She loves it. And let's give one to Emily. Is this Emily? Caroline. Two. They love sunflowers. Who doesn't love sunflowers? Now, we want to be careful because we want to save our sunflowers for... How much is this bag? 36 slot backpack. Whoa, 10k. That should be our goal because we need more space in our bag for sure. Uh, all right. Um, oh, wow. The prize pumpkin sells for almost 500 gold. The eggplants. Milk sells for 110 gold each. Whoa, money, money, money. Okay, well, let's go and check out the quests outside. No help wanted today. Oh, wow. Let's look in the trash then instead. No trash either. All right, well, what we're going to do is we're going to go see Robin and see how much the next upgrade costs on our house because we need to make some real golds now. We've got ourselves a level two house with a kitchen, which means we can make food, but... 
I keep- I, I thought that was gonna be revolutionary, I thought that was like the next step. It was gonna be amazing. But you know what? It's not. There's not much point. Well, okay, there's Maru. Should we give her some, a flower as well? There you go, but we can't let Haley know that we've been giving gifts to everybody, because she'll feel less special. And you never want a lady to feel less special. Hey! Have a nice walk? Yeah, I did. Really nice walk. Really long walk. Uh, upgrade the house. The size of my house. She can do it again. To add a nursery. Oh, that's for babies. Well, we'll have to talk to Haley about that. It's gonna cost 50,000 gold. And you'll also need to provide me with 150 pieces of hard wood. I'm interested, but I cannot afford that yet. What about farm buildings? Talk to me about farm buildings. So we could we could buy another coop, but I don't want to. Uh, I think, what does a coop do? We could build, couldn't, can't afford a barn. We could afford a well, a place to refill your watering can, but honestly, don't need it. Although they do look cool. Uh, silo, we don't need. They're so cheap though. Lots of materials. I forgot the material cost. There we go, a stable for a horse. This is what we want to do, but we need to get 100 hard wood to get there. Tell you what though, we're getting so many copper bars, it slipped my mind, but we should go and talk to Clint about getting our tools upgraded. I'm going to go back to the farm, get as many copper bars as I can, and uh, upgrade my tools all the way. But let's be quick, because his shop closes. Oh, sorry guys, his shop closes quite early. And I need to find out how much materials are needed apart from copper. Because I'm pretty sure you need more than just copper. Oh man, I hope his shop doesn't close at three. Because I'm cutting it very close. In fact, I might even miss it. Yeah, there it is, 250. Ooh, can't do it, can't do it. But I think his shop closes at five. I don't know though, let's find out. Did I get the spoon? No, I didn't. Jojo Mart. Oh, those scumbags. But you can actually choose Jojo Mart. Instead of, um, what's it called? Instead of the community center, if you want to be uh, like a profiteer. Hey, there you are, Clint. How's it going, my man? Upgrade tools. Okay. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so there is a cost. A steep cost. It's 2,000 gold per tool. And... You also need five copper bars. Well, okay, we, we definitely want a copper pickaxe, because there's some big stones on our farm that need busting. We also need a steel axe to get rid of the big round logs. That's going to require five iron bars. Now, we can transmute copper bars to iron. So our goal has to be five copper bars and five iron bars. 7,000 gold, we're going to accrue when our wheat... Wait, wait, was, was it, hang on a sec, was there... What's that in the corner? Is that something I can farm? No, it's a, oh, damn it. Well, never mind. Let's go back to base, back to our house, back to our farm. See if we can see Haley on the way. She should be out and about. She might even be at her home, which means we can drop by. Now, I think the higher friendship level you have with characters, the more likely they are to give you quests. So we really should be cultivating that. Okay, this is Haley's house, I think. No, it's not. She has the sun, of course, because it's like her hair. She is the sun. Now, where is she? She's not cooking. Is she in her room? No, don't eat the sunflower. She's not in here. Where could she be? Right, so, my super secret stalker guide says that Haley is down south of Marnie's ranch taking pictures. Let's find out. Oh, there she is, but she's on her way home now. Well, let's hijack. Uh, intercept. Intercept course engage. There we go. Oh, she loves sunflowers. I would have thought she's a bit tired of them by now, but no, turns out she loves them so much, she never gets bored of a bit of sunflower. So we're focusing on copper and iron bars to upgrade our tools, and the cash to get us there. Because with a better pickaxe, we can start breaking these big rocks, and with big rocks, we can get lots and lots of stone. With lots and lots of stone, we can... Uh, oh, cheese. With lots and lots of stone, we can build staircases in the mine to get us lower in the mine to get even more iron and perhaps gold so that we can make better sprinklers. And there we go. That is our goal. That is our prime focus. So let's get making copper. Let's get some of these trees up here because I think they're blocking the cave. Do you guys remember the cave? 
Let's go into the cave and see if there's anything in there. A little bit of stone too. There we go, here's the cave. I don't know if we've ever been in here. I'm starting to feel exhausted though. How do I get into the cave? Can I? Sjin, wait for my return on the dawn of your third year. Grandpa. Now I've heard about this. I've heard that your grandpa gauges how well you've done after three years. Ooh! What's this? I've never seen cherries in here before. I might have to throw away some stone to get... No, I'll throw in the maple seed. But, oh my god, cherries and strawberries. This is a super good find. Don't need the stone. And we'll leave those two at salmonberry. What even is salmonberry? I have no idea. There's some coal. Yoink. Let's make some more coal. Make some more copper. Now it's five ore per copper bar. So we've got 13. There was one in there, so it's 14. And then 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Now there is a recipe to turn copper bars into iron bars. And uh, we'll probably need 15 copper bars for five iron bars. That's okay though. That's a reasonable amount. Let's go put some more coal in. And while we're doing this, we might as well make some eggs and some more cheese. Let's get some milk and some eggs from the fridge. You don't need to store milk or eggs in the fridge. They, they, they don't go bad, luckily. All right, we'll swap that for the bucket, I think. Or the coal. Yeah, there we go. Eggs. Coal. Iron. And now we have some extra space as well. We can craft up those iron bars. So we want one, two, three, four, five. That's all of our copper bars gone. But we do have enough copper to get five more copper bars, right? One, two, three, four. And then the five is in there. Yeah, we should be good then. So tomorrow we can upgrade both our pickaxe and our axe into a steel axe. That's going to be crazy. Join me then, guys, and I'll see you for some wood chopping madness.